There's a new effort to recall Boise Mayor Lauren McLean. We told you about this last night at 10. Today, the mayor is responding to the recall effort. A group of Boiseans claim she isn't running the city the way she said she would when she campaigned. During a virtual conversation today with the City Club of Boise, the mayor shared her thoughts. Our Joey Prechtel has more. Boise Mayor Lauren McLean took a number of questions during the City Club event, and they ranged from the response to COVID-19, policing in Boise, as well as the new recall effort against her. She says she doesn't know who is trying to recall her, but says she remains focused on what got her into office, adding the people of Boise voted for her not once, but twice due to the mayoral runoff election. She says she brings a willingness to listen, a deep-seated belief in getting the community engaged and connecting the people. And I am not going to be distracted um, by something that's designed to divide or distract at a time now when it requires me to lead in a way that we didn't envision, and that is to address the crisis brought on by a pandemic um, and the economic fallout because of it. And so I remain day by day focused on the job that I have. The group also wants to recall Boise City Council member Lisa Sanchez. Joe Filicetti is one of the organizers. He talked to me on Tuesday. He claims the post by Sanchez about the man who shot a gun at a protest last month was racist. So he doesn't want someone like that making decisions for him or his family. Sanchez talked to our Brian Holmes about the post last month. I shot off my mouth, Brian. Is it really more dangerous what I said than somebody going down to our state house with, with their gun uh, ready to ready to hurt somebody. He did not have the safety engaged. I just don't think uh, me calling that out is more dangerous or harmful than someone going downtown and putting people's lives in danger. The group was in the first stage of the recall process. They turned in more than 20 signatures from registered voters in Boise yesterday. They still need to be verified by the Ada County Clerk's Office. Once that step is complete, they will have 75 days to gather approximately 26,000 signatures to recall McLean and approximately 9,000 signatures to recall Sanchez. Sanchez could not be reached for a comment on the recall effort. In Boise, Joey Prechtel, Idaho's News Channel 7.